Horseman Pat and his black and white cat. <coughs> Early in the morning, just as day is dawning, he picks up all the post bags in his van. Postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat and his black and white cat. The birds are singing and the day is just beginning. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Everybody knows his bright red band. All his friends will smile as he waves to greet them. Maybe. Never be sure there'll be knock. Ring parcels to your door. Postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat and his black and white cat. All the birds are singing and the day is just beginning. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Pat feels he's a really happy man. <laughs> This is so much fun. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. Hey, Dad. Hello, Julian. Hi, kids. Are you looking forward to the comet tonight? Mum says it's going to be amazing. Like a great big firework in space. She's taking us up to Greendale Peak to watch it. Um, Pat, have you got anything for me? Oh, sorry, Charlie. No, I haven't. Oh, hello. Special delivery service. Pat, it's Ben. I've got an urgent delivery. We're on our way. Is it my parcel? I'll find out, Charlie. I'd better hurry. Bye. Bye. We've got a special delivery. What's it going to be today, Jess? Yeah. Wow, this comet looks amazing. Hi, Ben. Hi, Pat. You're here. Great. Here is your special delivery. This little beauty is for Charlie Pringle. A telescope, of course. He wants it to watch the comet tonight. Lauren's picking the kids up at six o'clock sharp, so you've only got half an hour to get back to Greendale. I'd better take the bike. It's quickest. We're a bit low on petrol, Jess. Better stop at Ted's garage on the way. We'll still have enough time to get to Charlie. Meow. Pat, I forgot to give you this. It's a sat-nav. Uh, sat-nav? Satellite navigation. It tells you which way to go when you're driving. <laughs> ben, I think I know my way back to Greendale by now. Besides, I've got cat-nav. <laughs> but still, you never know when it may come in useful. Well, if you say so. Bye. Good luck, Pat. Look at this, Julian. A telescope. Wow. Yeah, it's a really powerful one. It'll be like the comet's as close as that apple. Cool. <laughs> Bet that's Dad now. Yeah. Yay. Let's go. Hey, kids. Everyone ready to go? Oh, I thought it was my telescope. Ted, are you there? I'm on the roof. Meow. What are you doing up there? <laughs> Come and see. I can't. I'm on a special delivery. Meow. Where are you going? OK, but very quickly. Wow! It's me, Ted Glenn, Comet Viewer. Made entirely from bits of old cars. That's amazing. Why don't you have a look? Well, OK, but it really will have to be quick. Wow. There's Arthur. Oh. <laughs> oh, and look. There's Lauren with the minibus and Charlie. Come on, Jess. We've got to get a move on.
Right you are then, Pop. Good luck. Thanks, Ted. Bye. See you, Pop. We should still make it, Jess. Ooh. Oh, no. That's all we need. Maybe Pat's on his way with my telescope. Can we wait a bit longer? I'm sorry, Charlie. If we don't go now, we'll miss the comet. Please. OK, just one more minute. Ah! Hello, Pat. Evening, Ajay. Right then, where's Charlie? Sorry, Pat. You're too late. The minibus has just gone. Oh, no! <laughs> ben, it's Pat. I'm afraid we didn't make it. The comet will be here soon. We've got to get the telescope to Charlie. I'll get it there. Don't worry. I'm going up to Greendale Peak to find them. Good luck. Give me a call if you need me. Thanks, Ben. Torch, map, spare socks, water and a length of rope. Thanks, Sarah. Bye. Be careful, won't you, Pat? It's easy to get lost up there. We'll be fine. See you later. Peak is this way. Um, this way? Meow. I'm sure this is right, Jess. where we started. Let's have a look at the map. Meow. Whoa! <coughs> Jess! <coughs> no, Jess! <coughs> Stop! Put it down! <coughs> oh, thanks, Jess. <coughs> Maybe Ben can help. Hello? Hmm. Pat, is that you? Ben? I, I can't hear you. Hello? The signal's gone. How are we going to find our way to Greendale Peak now? Hey, Pat, how are you doing, lad? The sat-nav, of course. Um, fine, thank you. I do need to get to Greendale Peak, and by the quickest route. Right. Destination Greendale Peak. Turn right at the next junction. Great. <laughs> Nearly there now, guys. Just in time for the comet. Yes. You can share my binoculars. Oh, thanks, Nera. Bet they're not as good as my telescope. The comet's going to be here very soon. I hope this sat-nav knows where it's going. Turn left through the gap of the hedgerow. And follow the footpath down to the stream, but be very, very, very careful. Footpath? Stream? Oh, this can't be right, can it? Hmm. That's Greendale Peak, all right. But how do we get there? Welcome to Greendale Peak, children. The comet should be arriving in just a few minutes, so everyone quickly up to the top. Cool! Come on! Wow, wicked! And mind where you're going. The ground is very sticky in places. My hat! Come on, Julia, keep up. You don't want to miss the comet. Hey, hey, steady. Oh. 
OK, Jess. Take it nice and slowly. <laughs> yes, it's easy for some. <sighs> we haven't much time. Let's go. everyone. Meow. That can't be them. Can it? I can't see from here. I need something like a telescope. Meow. It is them. Oh, we're on the wrong hill, Jess. We'll have to go back the way we came. Meow. Shh. Meow. Oh, steady. Yes. Look! The comet's on its way! Oh, the minibus! We're nearly there, Jess. I think we might just make it. Oh, oh no! I'm stuck! Oh, 60 seconds to go till the comet! 60! 59! 58! Help! I'm stuck in the mud! Help! The rope, Jess! I need the rope! Oh, oh thanks, Jess. Come on, this time! Oh, yes! Oh, phew! Come on, Jess. Meow. Let's find Charlie. 31, 30, 29. Wait, Jess. Left. All right. Meow. Meow. Jess? Julian's hat. Well done, Jess. Here you are, Charlie. Try them. Thanks, Mira. Oh, wow! I can see Pat! Dad! Pat! I'm here! Hi, Pat! Oh. My hat! It's almost Five. time! Charlie! Four! Quickly! Three. Your telescope! Two. Oh, One. thanks, Pat! Oh. Look! There's the cockpit! Oh, wow. wow! It's brilliant! Oh, it's so beautiful! I can't see anything! <laughs> you might want to take the lens cap off first. <laughs> You're a real star. Well, I couldn't have done it without my cat mouth. <laughs> Special delivery service. Mission accomplished. Careful, Bat Boy. Mind my washing. What are you up to today, Julian? I'm going to meet Bill. We're helping Amy with Animal Day. You take your pet along and Amy gives you advice on how to look after it. There's going to be some extra special guests. Oh. 
special delivery service. Pat speaking. Pat, I've got a rather unusual delivery for you. Can you get here right away? We're on our way. See you later, Bat Boy. Have fun at Animal Day. Thanks, Dad. Come on, Jess. We've got a special delivery. What's it going to be today? Special delivery service. What's it going to be today? Hello, Ben. Meow. Ben. Shh. No. There you are. So, where's this unusual? Shh. Follow me. Oh. Is that it? Shh. But. Shh. Sorry. They're fruit bats. Amy's borrowed them from Pancaster Zoo for her animal day. Ah, her extra special guests. They've got to be at the surgery by one o'clock at the latest. In that case, we'd better get going. Come on, Jess. And don't forget. Bats sleep all day, and wake up at night. So you've got to be very, very, very quiet. Don't worry, Ben. We won't let you down. Come on, Jess. Let's get these bats to Greendale. Meow. Meow. <laughs> Look out, everyone! It's Bat Boy. <laughs> and the black bat. Come on, pumpkin. Here to help, horsewoman. Come on. Oh, I wish one of you bat people would give me a hand with pumpkin. Uh, the real bats will be arriving soon. Oh. Shh, 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 shh. Shh. didn't wake our fruit bats. Meow. No, still fast asleep, I reckon. Meow. <laughs> Sorry, Pat, got an emergency. Can I get past? It's so noisy here, Jess. Meow. Let's get these sleepy bats to Amy. Meow. Pumpkin, good pony. Look out, there's Nosebag. Who's Nosebag? The world's greatest superhero pony. <laughs> you see, mm. Pumpkin, you are a super pony. Mm. Now, where are my bats? They should be here by now. <laughs> Dad. Hey up, Pop. We saw you coming. Want to see me latest invention? I can't stop, Ted. I'm on a special... It won't take a minute. Al, get ready. Right out, Ted. I'm on a special delivery. I can't stop. OK, Al. Let it go. The Ted Glenn Automatic Bird Scaring Machine. Impressive, eh? <laughs> oh, no! What's up, Pat? My special delivery. What's wrong with it? It's woken up. I need to check it. It's okay, they're still asleep. 
Look out, oh, Jess! Oh, 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 oh. I wonder what's happened to Pat. He should definitely be here by now. Let's go look for him, Bat Boy. Good idea, Black Bat. Yeah. Hmm. Hi, Pat. Right. I've got the information you need. If bats are woken during the day, they'll generally fly around until they find a place they can go back to sleep. Somewhere that's dark, quiet and high. Good luck. Find those bats. Did you get that? Dark, quiet and high. That rules out the farmer's market. Right. This is the plan. Alf, you search the station. The bats might get in under the roof there. Ted, you head over to the water mill. They might be hiding out in one of your barns. Meow. Jess and I will look around Greendale. Understood? Understood. Good luck. Anything? I'm afraid not. What? <gasps> Why not? What's happened, Dad? The bats, they've escaped. Oh, no. What you going to do? We're trying to find them, Bill. We know they like dark, quiet places where they can hang upside down and... <gasps> Dad? That's it. What? I know exactly where to find the bats. Come on. Yeah. Jess. I'm sorry, girls. Animal Day can't start until Pat arrives with the special guests. I've got to get them settled before we can do anything else. When will that be? I don't know, Lucy. <clears throat> Soon, I hope. Don't worry, Amy. Pat won't let you down. Can you hear me, Ted? Hi, Pat. I want you to go inside your workshop. I'm in, Pat. Now, go up the stairs to the upper level where you hang your washing. I'm there, Pat. What's this all about? Have a look at the washing line. Can you see anything strange? An apron? Nothing strange about that. A pair of pants? A couple of bats? Oh! My heck! They're here, Pat! The bats are in here! Hanging upside down, next to my clean socks! Stay there, Ted. We're on our way. Oh, heck. Pat? The bats are in here, Alf. Come on. I'll use this net. Can we come in too, Dad? Sorry, boys. You'd better wait outside. We don't want to frighten the bats. Oh. Alf? Oh, thanks, my boy. They're up there. Are you going to come up here and get them? Or not? Ted, we're just coming. Follow me, Alf. Oh! Can you reel in the washing line a bit, Ted? I'll try. That's it. Easy does it. Shall we see how they get on with the bats? I don't know, Bill. Dad says... We won't scare them. Not if we're really quiet. They won't even know we're there. That's it, Ted. Nearly there. Come on, Bat Boy. Gotta be quiet. Just a tiny bit further. Come on, Bat Boy. Come on. Come on. Oh no. What's wrong, dear? It's almost one o'clock. I can't start the animal day without the special bats. Perhaps you should ring them. I'm really sorry, Pat. 
I only wanted to see the bats. How are we going to get them down from up there? Don't worry, boys. I'll think of something. Oh. Whoa! Oh, what's this? Julian, is this yours? Uh... Hold on. It's given me an idea. Boys, you don't happen to have any more apples, do you? Yeah. What are you doing, bud? Ready? Come on, bats. Look, yummy apples. Mmm. Hey. They're fruit bats. They love apples. Yeah. Come, Come on, on bats. Come on. Come on. Come on. Well, I'm never. Right, let's get this special delivery back on track. Oh. Where are the bats? Oh, Where are the bats? Are, the bats? are they coming, Thompson? This is a disaster, Ben. What's happened to my bats? Looks like Pat will be with you any minute now, Amy. Am I glad to see you? Have you got my special guests? I certainly have. But before I introduce you, everyone must be very, very quiet. <gasps> because they're fast asleep. <sighs> Thank you so much for getting them to me on time, Pat. I couldn't have done it without Ted and Alf. Oh, Bat Boy and the Black Bat. Special delivery service. Mission accomplished. Shh.